in my presentation I mentioned that the method is also using web page tool to make MCNP input we will see this web page tool amid this application using PHP web page web programming language uh, it's about database application for creating MCNP input file of aqueous homogeneous reactor the application description create MCNP input file from origin output file or origin dot pch file and then convert origin dot pch data into MCNP material card input data format database library material card is xsdir or correct section directory 66c until 25c this is a MCNP cross section data library and then also addition of grad on the data with the same nuclide or zide how to use this we have to choose the file of the origin output for example for the cycle one for a cycle one it means uh, the end of the cycle one after the rec the reactor is operated for two days I, I mean for three days and two days start one we submit this input uh, the origin output file we see right here this is the zeit or identified number or code for the nuclide and this is the atom per barn centimeter or atomic density we will create the MC input file download we see the result in the download folder for a simple simplicity we will rename this input file ehr first cycle and we will do the same thing for the second cycle at the end of the second cycle and also for the third cycle We also rename for the third cycle input. Cycle. And we will move this file to the MCNP folder. Uh, we will see what what is the difference between the origin output this one with the MCNP input that we have create we just created this is the origin output we see right here this is the nuclide identifier or identification of the nuclide in the origin output 
and in the MCNP we see this one is the identification of the nuclide for example this one is for hydrogen we see right here the symbol is different because this is the output of origin and this is the input of MCNP we also see this one is the concentration of the for example this one is hydrogen this one the unit is in mole and for the MCNP the unit is atom density or atom per barn centimeter and the other important thing is in this origin output we will see it's a uh, 122 row and per row we will see there is a uh, one two and three nuclide it's mean there is there are about 360 nuclide in the origin output and we see right here in the MCNP we start the material of the fuel in the line of 19 row 19 until row 139 so it's only about 120 nuclide because this is because not all of the material or nuclide that is consists in the available in the origin output we uh, we will use in the MCNP input because there is no data processor library for that nuclide we will run this uh, MCNP input and prefer to use total commander we will run this we just need to drag this one and then enter we see right here the MCNP is running and we see right here and there is warning for example this is 90 this is atomic number for thorium like delayed neutron cross section this is uh, about data of the cross section this is uranium 240 and we will not see lack of delayed cross section uh, data for the uranium 235 and here we see the the data or the output or the iteration of the first cycle we see right here this is the k effective 1.2 and it's changed to be 1.09 this is still a uh, iteration and the iteration will finish until we see right here in the input 115 iteration so it will take time